Pixie and welcome to Pixie's Playhouse. On today's episode we will be trying Cocoa Puffs Popcorn with Cocoa Glaze and we will be comparing it to Cocoa Puff Cereal. Now I've always thought that Cocoa Puffs was a more chocolatey version of Kix and that Trix was a more fruity version of Kix as well. All right, so let's start with this popcorn. Now it says Cocoa Puffs popcorn with cocoa glaze. So let's cut it open and see. There we go. I have a bit of trivia for you. Uh, in what 90s movie did a character say about his friend that they're cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs? Now you have to name the movie and also the character who said it in the comment section below. All right, so here is the bowl of the uh, Cocoa Puffs popcorn, and it definitely looks like some pieces are much more glazed than others. Uh, so let's try to get some of the really glazed uh, pieces going. This is pretty uh, glazed, so let's see. Really hard to chew, very um, tough. Mm. I'm not getting any Cocoa Puffs taste at all right now. Um, it just tastes like a little bit of a chocolatey caramel corn with almost like a heavy duty molasses kind of thing happening. No. Tastes like Cracker Jacks, not even much of a chocolatey taste at all. All right, considering that it's kind of hard on the teeth, it doesn't taste like Cocoa Puffs, and um, Sunny's not on the bag, that's a big drawback right there. Going to give this one six out of ten horns in the air, throw it uh, in the pit. If you just want a caramel corn, go with Cracker Jacks or something else. If you're looking for uh, chocolatey uh, popcorn, maybe try like a Twix one or something like this. This is not the way to go. All right, Cocoa Puffs. We've got our friend uh, Sunny the uh, Cuckoo Bird, who's absolutely cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. And we actually have a cool little arcade game on the back of the box featuring our friend uh, from Cookie Crisp, uh, Chip the Wolf. We've got the Trix Rabbit, and we got Sunny there uh, with a cool little arcade activity. All right, so this makes chocolatey milk. We've got Sunny with his giant straw. So let's see. All right, let's cut this bad boy open. Ah, it smells like chocolate. All right, so we have a nice big bowl there. So I'll show you what it looks like. And let's try some dry. It's not that chocolatey to me. Great chocolatey taste, it says on the box. But also, I haven't really had this since I was a kid, but I think this is a pretty small Cocoa Puff. Uh, I remember them being larger. This is kind of like, I don't know if this is a green pea, a very tiny green pea. Uh, I don't know. Tastes like Nesquik so far, but actually not as good. All right. Maybe the milk will make the world of uh, difference. Let's pour in the almond breeze and see what we can do with that. Add a bit more of the breeze so that the cereal's uh, not too crispy, not too soggy, just the right amount of milk there. Mix it around, get that chocolate milk going. All right. I don't know. It's not really very chocolatey. It's 
not even really turning the milk all that chocolatey yet. I'm like mixing it to try to force chocolate milk, but the chocolate milk does not want to voluntarily come. Yeah, this quick's way better. Just the milk. The milk's like a very light brown, almost non-existent color as well. It's not like super, super chocolatey dark milk. Let's see if we can just get some milk there. No. Very disappointed in Sunny. Uh, I'm gonna have to give this a six out of 10 uh, horns in the air. To me, it's not chocolatey enough. The pieces are very small. Uh, doesn't really generate a good chocolate milk. I'm gonna throw it in the pit. Sunny the Cuckoo Bird, I'm really sorry, but your cereal and your popcorn are being trashed today. Um, you know, it's unfortunate, but uh, has to be done. There have been several uh, Cocoa Puff spin-offs or versions over the years, um, including Brownie Crunch, uh, Hot Cocoa Cocoa Puffs, Swiss Miss Cocoa Puffs, um, Puff Stars, Cocoa Puffs Combo, Cocoa Puffs Oatmeal, Cocoa Puffs Cereal Bars. Um, so, I mean, hopefully some of those products are better than the two we tried today. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe because we're trying to build a cool community and be cool, honey bunnies.